The purpose of this video is to illustrate how the dot dinking tools function. The tools consist of uh, a lower die with a hole in the spherical radius and the upper tool is a punch with the uh, spherical radius on the end and the whole principle here is that the spherical radius will capture or pinch the material against the edge of the hole on the lower die and uh, uh, it's a very efficient way of cutting with a minimal amount of uh, pressure. The way that you would normally set this up is you would install your tools, bring your upper punch down to the full bottom part of the stroke, raise the lower die up until you feel it hit and make firm contact with the upper die. You can usually then just raise the lower die up about a quarter of a turn uh, and then double check, see if it cuts. If it does, fine. If it didn't cut for some reason, you just raise it a little bit more until you get the uh, tool cutting the hole uh, cleanly. Some materials may require a little more pressure. Um, some materials that have very fine fibers or they're designed to be tough like Kevlar can require uh, a little bit more pressure. But that's as simple as it is, and I hope that this will help in setting up the dot dinking dies.